Hello everyone. Hi Donna. Hello. Hi, we are Happy Heart Treasures. I'm Steve. I'm Donna. We are resellers full time in Lincoln, Nebraska. He's not telling me what we're talking about, so. Um, it's a secret. It's top secret. Oh, I forgot to say. We homer so stuff. <laughs> like, you're gonna throw everybody off. <laughs> hey, I want to talk today about well, I'm gonna tell you we have a problem and we I think we need to fix it. Uh we are a Happy, upbeat, fun couple. We love our lives. We love each other. We love our marriage and everything else. But every now and then, especially doing what we do, he just like grumpy. any job. Are we talking about no. you being grumpy? No, not at all. <laughs> you can get in a rut. And right now, we are a little down. <clears throat> a little a little bit in a rut reselling. You know, we got this new air conditioner. And we're like, oh, we're going to just crush it for the next. Yeah. Who knows how long because we got so much good stuff and we are having motivation problems. Oh we are God. having And just... we have lots and lots of stuff around us. Yeah, but so... not as much as we used to. But I I think I know what the problem is. I think I know how to fix it, but I just want to address. I wanna I want us to, ever since we started this channel, I wanna be real and I wanna show you the real us. And the real life of a reseller. Yes. And I really think a lot of our problem lies in what we're trying to do and being so focused on one thing that it's hurting everything else. Oh. Does that make sense, Donna? Yeah, but what is it? She, <laughs> she, nothing bad. Nothing bad. <laughs> uh, we're going to get into that. I have a couple shout outs to do and then I'm going to tell you what we're going to do today to fix our problem today. Okay, so if you follow us and you watch our videos, then you know kind of what the boat we're in. Like, right, we have our garage all cleaned up. We have it all organized. We have lots of good stuff to sell. We keep talking about that. Yeah. But we're so focused on, because we want to show things, we want to do these discovery videos. So we're focused on, we have all this stuff that we've shown, and we're focused on we have to get rid of that now. We don't want to just have it sitting here so we can show more stuff. But it's all Christmas. But it's a bad section of the stuff that we got because there's a lot of Christmas stuff. It's She's not right. exciting. And Is that so what it, you say? Yes, we've lost the excitement. We've lo we've also lost it because we haven't went to any we garage sales for the love and feeling. <laughs> how how many weeks has it been since you've been to more than one garage sale? Oh, five. Five weeks. Mm -hmm. That's not what we do. Are we going garage selling? So, <gasps> are we going garage selling? We are going to go hit some garage sales. Yay! So here's what we're going to do. The last few days, like we're, we come out here and we're working, but we're just in a rut. And I'm like, I can't, this ain't the stuff I want to do or nothing, but we're so focused on, we can't bring new stuff or I am. We can't bring new stuff in until we get through this stuff because I don't want to just store stuff. Right? Mm -hmm. So what, Donna? And you know, you do have to get through all the stuff, death pile, the stuff you don't want to deal with. But sometimes it's got to be fun too. Yeah. Yeah. So I did agree last night. I said, you know what? I agree with you. And you know what? Let's get some just new stuff, fresh stuff out of the Yay. storage unit. Let's just you know what? This Christmassy stuff, this can wait. It's kind of silly to be. I mean, Christmas sells all year long, all year long. Don't f don't <clears throat> misunderstand that. It does, yeah. But listing the you know Christmas stuff over and over and We're over. We're not a Christmas seller, so that's not our passion. Yeah, Is like that what we you're know. Saying? Yeah, we, like, we yeah. have a friend Randy that has. <clears throat> he loves Christmas and he loves Christmas stuff. It's not our passion. We love selling stuff, but you know. <laughs> so anyway, here's what we're gonna do. We're in a rut and we're a little bummed out lately. So we're gonna fix that today. My plan to fix that today is the following. First thing we're gonna do, we're gonna go through and we're gonna get Donna coffee from Scooters. Oh, we're gonna get some yes. breakfast. It's like noon because we just couldn't get the motivation to get but going today. But we don't today. go to the coffee store unless we're like going somewhere. So on a trip or to go garage selling. So I haven't had coffee from Scooters in... Yeah. And Five so this weeks. this morning, just for clarification, we were supposed to, we've been talking about going to a possible private pick scenario thing. Something came up and that oh. got put off until next week. But I rescheduled sometime. it. 
it's rescheduled, so we're going to do that next week at some point. I'm not sure exactly what day. So we're going to get coffee. And then the next thing we're going to do, we talked about we're going to go to storage, and we're going to get new stuff. We might film in storage, or we might bring it home, but we're going to get different stuff, not Christmas stuff. And I thought, you know what? Right by the scooters, we saw signs. There's like a neighborhood garage sale over there. I'm very particular about I love to go garage sailing on Thursdays and not Fridays because I always kind of feel like it's picked over, but I know there's still good stuff out there. But I don't care because we need to go garage selling. We need to go and have the hunt. Most of the pleasure of this job is the thrill of the hunt. Oh, yes. And while it's fun to look through boxes that we're not sure what's in there. And it's the thrill of the sale, too. And if you don't have wow, exciting stuff, you don't ever get the thrill of the sale. Yeah, I think we have a lot of wow, exciting stuff in storage. Yes. But finding it in the wild, we haven't done it in so long that I really think that's missing from Will our life. we remember life. how? Yeah. We're not going to take the camera to garage sales. We're just trying to get out and live a little again and get back to what we do, Hi. what we know what we know we do. But we're going to kind of chronicle through the day here and show what we we're going to get stuff in storage. We might film oh. there. We're going to if we get some stuff at garage sales, we're going to show what we found and everything else. So that's we're going to try to get out of this rut we're in because yay. Last thing we want to do is turn on the camera and be like, oh, "This is great," and just be faking it. So I'd rather tell you, I'm "Hey, I'm always happy." I'd rather tell you, hey, we're we're struggling a bit, <laughs> but we're going to try to fix it. Yes. All right, before we get her coffee, I have a couple things to cover real quick. Number one, we suck. <laughs> what? <laughs> um, we talked a little bit last time. Don has been taking stray bullets on YouTube. Oh, funny. We, got, we, we both took it, so now it's both of us, and that's okay. And this is hilarious. I wouldn't even bring this up, but I think it's hilarious. And so I'm going to read you this comment. This is on the storage unit video that's been, you know, so popular or whatever. Was this yesterday? This was yesterday. Yeah, yesterday. We're already in a rut enough, and then people are out here hurting <laughs> our feelings. This says... We are, we're tougher than that, but... This is from Teresa Toth, 1300. I might as well say your name because she's posted it. She said, you don't show what is in the bags you suck won't watch again <laughs> i the only thing i can think we can and we were trying to think we're like what bags because we did go back and watch that video recently one about you too oh that i'm a bull in a china shop and i don't argue that so that's they just okay. said you're a bull uh, yeah maybe know, they a mean a you're a shop. bully no it said bull no it was let's read it all right let's read that one. First time watching hubby's like a bull in a china shop oh okay. lol so they were laughing when they said it. No, <laughs> he is. and then and I am. I absolutely am. Well, he's so tall and big, and his yeah. hands are huge, and yeah. Uh, so we suck. So <laughs> if anybody watches us still, thank you because I appreciate you watching, even though we suck. You know what? We were talking about this, and even the negative comments feed the algorithm. So come on. Oh yeah, absolutely. I gave that little comment a heart. And I said, I'm sorry we suck, but I guess we're just not your cup of tea, you know, with a laughing face. Like, it's funny. I've, I'm humored by that. I, my feelings are not hurt. I'm not, we don't suck. Uh, we're, we're okay. So, <laughs> uh, then I want a quick, a couple quick shout outs. All right, my first shout out is LaDonna from Bayou Belle yeah. Vintiques. Yeah. Uh, she lives in Omaha about an hour away, and she messaged us. She had a standing, uh, adjustable standing desk that she was no longer using and to see if we wanted it. So I actually brought it in and I'm going to use that as my shipping table. So it's a little higher because I'm taller. Oh, so your back will be better. Yeah. So that's awesome that she, over the whole that she uh, reached out and gave us that table. Yeah, so that's thank awesome. Thank you. And the second one is to a viewer, Sharon. Sharon reached out from the last video and she says, hey, I'd really like to have that. It's a little one of the little cars we show, a uh, Elmo firefighter car. And so she messaged and emailed, and she is uh, getting the little car from yes, us. Thank you. And we're shipping that out uh, later today. So thank you to both of you. We really do appreciate the support that we do get. Yes. Um, but anyway, we better get Donna some coffee. That's exciting. Before, <laughs> before she turns on me. Uh, I'm just kidding. All right, we're going to go get coffee. We're going to hit some garage sales, and we'll catch up after a bit. All right, we are at our storage unit. We got Donna coffee. We got some breakfast. She's feeling better. Yes. And we went to about a dozen garage sales. Yeah. Didn't find much. Not much, but it was fun. Um, 
basically like one neighborhood sale every single sale we went to they're like oh yesterday was crazy yesterday we sold almost all our stuff yeah. one lady's like all i have left is a kitchen table so the we, day to go in lincoln is usually thursday yeah so. yeah so we missed out but we we found just a few things it was very slim pickings but we gave it a shot so we're going to show you what we found real quick what okay i found two of these starbucks coffee mugs you know I'm a sucker for coffee, Starbucks scooters. So two of these for 25 cents a piece. And then I found a Yeti for $2. And it's a Magnolia Silos Yeti. And from Waco, Texas. That's, what's their names? Um, from Magnolia. It was just on my... Those people. Chip and Diane. There you go. Diana. And then I got this for one of my kids. <laughs> And then I make the coffee cozies and I realized that I didn't get any posted on our channel. So I'm going to post some, but I got these for five cents. They're to go on the outside of some black and orange ones for Halloween. Cool. And just some other little buttons to do that with for five cents a piece. All right, and then I found, I think four things, three things. One of them Donna found, and then I just verified it. This was like a sympathy purchase, honestly. We're at a garage sale in this. Poor lady, I don't think she was getting any customers or anything. But it's a, I don't even know how I to open I think I broke it. the zipper. She broke it. It's a whole bunch of like kitchen scrubbing pads and stuff. Well, and our kitchen. table, we need to clean off our white tables. Yeah. And anyway, those a bunch are of textured. cleaning supply stuff for four bucks. So she's like, well, I'll take four. And I just, I could use the scrubbers. So we grabbed them. Yeah. Um, found this little halo little halo dudes it's brand new but it is cracked but it was two bucks and this is probably about 15 on ebay i looked up then i did find this it is dusty but it's a kiss it's got a booklet the story of kiss it's got a 19 merchandise catalog from 2002 and it's got five cds i did look and they are in like perfect condition no scratches anything like that it's like that case has a crack, but I could replace the case. The case, yeah. So I got this for five dollars. I think it sells for around thirty bucks. And lastly, we were at a garage sale and they had a bunch of Rainbow High dolls. And Donna grabbed this and she says, "Is this a Monster High?" And I said, "Well, I'm not sure." So I Google lensed it. It's a Monster High. And it was only a dollar, so we got that for a dollar. So that's it. The garage sale is slim pickings. Let's go, uh, we're gonna open some boxes here at the storage unit, nobody's around, so we're gonna show you some new stuff in there. This morning when I woke up, it was like 73 degrees, and so I'm like, oh, it's beautiful out, so I wore like running <laughs> pants. Mistake, it is too warm for this. Too warm for running pants. I need shorts. Right. Here's where we're at. I know you've seen this before, if you keep watching, this is all Iowa, all, everything over here. This is Turtle Buy. We're gonna go through some of these boxes right here, I know, and I think Donna wants to check a couple Turtle Buy boxes. So, we're probably gonna do, I don't know, five, six, seven boxes, and then we'll wrap it up. But I do think new inventory is what we needed. We needed to hit some garage sales, even though they were crappy. I think that just kind of reset our brains a little bit. All right, this one is from Iowa. This is a Donna box. You need to do this box. We're gonna have Donna do pretty boxes. I don't... Yeah, because you're a bull. Bull in a china shop, that's right. Oh, these are all precious moments, you guys. And it ranges from itty bitty ones to um, the, the full size ones. They're probably down in there. This one. Okay. I just kind of layered them with, because I was running out of paper, so I just the small ones so we've got the bigger sizes yep. like this and um and you put some on dollar auction they did pretty well right? right they did they did really well um for um precious moments things they did like seven dollars five to seven dollars a piece hey by the way um for people that watch and don't know what dollar auction is we covered every now and then we're going to do a video probably the next one we're going to talk about whatnot versus dollar auction versus there's a new there's a new uh selling platform where resellers can sell to other resellers and it's very interesting but in our situation we kind of have that already and we're going to go over all that like we talked about doing a video about that so i think that'll be the next one 
So I'm going to show a few more in here because I don't want people to say, you don't show what's in there <laughs> because we had that comment. So just because we know maybe what's in a box doesn't mean everybody else does. But this whole box is full of that whole shelf of precious moments yep. that we saw. There is um, in this box a set of nativity, precious moment nativity. Right, so I'll take this home and we can list this on the dollar auction and on eBay. Okay. All right, Hopefully. this one's more of me, a me thing. A Steve box. Uh, we have DVDs and there's a lot of brand new, oh, unopened. This one's brand new, brand new. Uh, some used ones, but another brand new one. There's a lot of DVDs. I grabbed a bunch of games. new games. I don't know if this one's new, Skip Bow, but everybody likes Skip Bow and, and Five Crowns. Um, oh, here. More DVDs, new, new. Jumbo playing cards for over the hill for old people. <laughs> or people like us that can't see without our glasses. Now they're new. In here we got a brand new Phase 10, 25th anniversary. <laughs> few books down in here. Let's see what these are. Uh, I don't know what these are. Jewel Tweed. It's a Nebraska Bride. Nebraska Brides. Yeah, not Nebraska. familiar with that. Yeah, something to do with Nebraska. Somebody might be. Looks like a puzzle back there. Some There's videos. a bunch more DVDs in there. There's another game, another book. Let's see here. What is this? Christmas trivia game. Oh, that's brand new. Brand new, unopened. And then we just have some more DVDs. New one, new one. Sealed, so sealed. Many these of are, them are new. these are all sealed. Guardians of the Galaxy. Um, yeah. A lot so of a lot movies. of these common movies, even if they are sealed. Or even if they are common, will they'll still be worth a little more than if they? Well, yeah, you, new sealed like a lot. Well, a lot of. Let's take this for example, Minions. Minions is super super popular, so they made eight billion of these movies. So it's sealed, but it's still probably not a eBay movie, because there's probably, if I were to guess, I'd guess, two thousand of these listed and probably. 200 sold i don't know for sure but popular movies are tough but so what do you, you check do? them all so i put them on the dollar auction i put them in lots on the dollar auction i'll put like a lot of i don't know six or seven new sealed dvds on there and make some more um desirable since they well, are yeah. sealed well yeah anytime anytime you get new overused it's yeah. a good thing yeah i'm gonna put this back we're gonna call that good <laughs> There's Donna. I pulled the box off the cart and <laughs> she did a wheelie. <laughs> That's funny. <Woo! laughs> okay. All right. What's next? That was scary. From Iowa. Looks like crafty stuff. There's some crafting things. Embossing tape. A brand new set of Fiskers, crafting scissors, kind of like stuff. your DVDs. New crafting stuff sells well yep. if it's new. Yeah, anytime you can get new stuff. And those are scrapbooking pages. Yep. Scrapbooks. Some more. Here's a brand new scrapbook. What do you got here? Some fabrics. Yep. Fabric, fabric, oh, fabric. Good. Some fabric. Here's a brand new sealed conga game. Right there. 
And then we have what's in here? Magnetic photo frames. So looks like it's taped. I believe that's what it is. It's mm -hmm. heavy. Mm -hmm. Magnetic photo frames. Some more fabrics. Burlap. There's some burlap in your life. Mm -hmm. We can hook you up. And then looks like we have a set of blue dishes. Pyrex, I think. These are anchor. Anchor hawking. Yeah, anchor ovenware mixing bowl. This is one quart. So there's a whole set here. I don't want to break that. I would get in trouble. Mm -hmm. Yeah, whole set. I'll take the another one I'm there, nest. and then another one, and then one on the bottom. So set of four nesting cobalt blue anchor hawking bowls. Some crayons, it looks like. Here's some there's Corel a, dishes. There's a whole set of those, I think. Um, the pattern is not what the bowls look like. Must well, be one has a pattern, the others are just plain white Corel bowls. Oh. And then we got more of the blue. Oh, but it's the same size set? Yeah. It looks like it. So there's basically a second set here of those blue. Oh, these look different on the bottom, but they are still anchor hawking. Conventional oven microwave safe. No stove top, no broiler use. One quart. There's some cool blue bowls. And that's it for this one. I'm picking a smaller box. Okay. Oh, I see good stuff in there. Okay. Is there a glare? Can you see it? Look at that. What do you call those? The silhouettes. Silhouettes. The bubble glass. Yeah. There's a whole bunch of those. There's a whole bunch more where those came from. Those are vintage. See the bubble glass. Pretty cool, huh? These, I'm not sure what these things are. Are they banks? Oh, it's got an LED light. Is that broken? So that must light up because it had a little switch on the bottom. Oh, yeah. Okay. We're on 66 sign. Might need a little super glue. Yep. Oh, some die cast cars. Ooh. They have little moving, moving parts. Yep. And this little die. Oh, his, the seat moves. Yeah. Fabric. Another car. Used for packing. We'll get those cleaned up. Dusted up. Yeah. Oh, wow. I didn't even realize there was cars anywhere. Nice. I don't know what the years are or anything on these, but... Some of you will. It'll I'm say on sure. the bottom too, so when we clean them up, we'll know what to we'll know what to call it. Okay. Is there any more in there? It's all fabric. I think it's it, like it's fabric. It's just fabric. That's right. it. Just just lots of fabric pieces. Okay. So I'm going to put these back in here carefully. Very nice. Donna, what did you find there? Books. It's all books, but they're like horror, vampire, love, like type of books. And you did look up like some of the names, like they're, they're selling lots, right? They'll sell in lots, yeah. Yeah, this is from the Turtle Buy. Just a whole box full of books because I love me some books to carry around. <laughs> yeah, he doesn't. <laughs> okay. Alright, well let's try something more fun. Okay. I'm gonna grab just a couple more boxes from over here and then we're gonna do a box or two from the other side. It'll be completely different stuff. Here is a box. More movies. Um oh, man. the Godfather DVD collection, brand new sealed. Look at all these Blu-rays, these are all brand new sealed. It's just a whole box of movies stand-up comedians this is like a 
comedy. All wrapped. Everything. So a box looks like a box full of might be all brand new. So that's a good box right there. See if we can find something super cool in there. Okay. All right. Let's see what's in here. Oh, be careful. Oh. These are fragile. This is from it's a starfish. Yep. And another starfish. There's yeah, there's a couple. Pick up the starfish. And what do we got? Feels like another sea creature. No, it's glass. A sea creature? That's a kind of cool oh, piece yeah, of glass it's like there. Kind of Murano style like looking thing. Yep. There's a vase. Does it have a name? Uh no, it says 21 in it. What's that name? It says Warranted 22 karat gold USA. So it's Ooh. karat gold flakes or whatever. Karat gold flakes. Feels like a home interior decoration piece here. Oh, there's some sand dollars. Um. And a my heart belongs to the sea. That back so I don't break those. It's like a bathroom. Must have been. Oh, I see blue. Some starfish glass it trinket? trinket trays, looks trays like. or something. A set of those. This is another decorative piece. It says beach. That makes a uh, really cute decor for a room yep. with beach theme right. or a beach house. What's that? Oh, it's a cornflower. What do they call it? Corel? Corel, yeah, it's a measuring cup on the inside. Oops. Listed in there. And the measurements are listed on the inside of there. What do we got down in here? Oh, there's a, the a corral dishes. Yep. <laughs> and some more dishes underneath. Corral. Let's see what's in this little thing here. Oh, I've got a seahorse. Yep. That's cute. Cool. Looks like Pyrex anchor, anchor hawking. Measuring cups. There's one. It's probably another matching. That's a Pyrex. Big old Pyrex measuring bowl there. There you go. In really good condition. That's good. Some bowls down there. And then lastly is. What is that? A food processor? Little food processor, yep. That is exactly what that is. That's it for this box, this heavy box. Heavy, heavy box. Another All right, we're gonna go to the other storage unit now. What I really wanna get to is like back here in those totes, those totes. I'd like to get back there, but obviously we can't really do that. But I know back in there, there's stuff from the shed that you guys didn't get to see. You know what? Donna, on the other hand, is determined and says, I'm gonna get back there and get that stuff. Target? A box of Target. There are some broken ones in there, but that's okay. It's not open yet. Yeah, I know. It just, you can tell there's rattle in there. Like there's some broken pieces. <laughs> Look at her go. Okay, let's let's get a, Donna dug the tote out of the back. Let's see what we got. We got. Uh, camo netting. Yep. I don't know what you do with that. <laughs> Camouflage and 3D blind fabric. Yep, brand new for there hunters. And and this is where we got some camo. You guys, it's a new tag. Mossy oak. Yeah, brand new big old camo hoodie. That's good, that right? Even, yeah, I think so. That might even fit me, but then you wouldn't be able to see me. Yeah, because you'd be camouflaged. 
That's right. What's this one? That is a what brand? Whitewater Outdoors Ducks Unlimited. This uh, is a heavy jacket. Heavy, heavy coat there. Oh look, it's got the, hold on. It's got the Ducks Unlimited embroidery right there oh yeah so that's a nice coat right there that's I think. a heavy coat it says Gore-Tex obviously it's not the right time of year but it'll be here before we know it yeah what's this I don't know um this isn't insulated it's just that's a Carhartt though right a work jacket it looks yeah. like that's a Carhartt work coat right there canvas Look at that. That's awesome. It doesn't look in bad condition either. Like maybe no, worn little, once or twice. A little bit dirty, but not much. That's wow. an excellent condition. That's cool. And then. What's this? That's a leg. It's a what? It's a leg, maybe? I think it's a leg. Looks like a leg. Yeah, it looks like it. Why don't you have two? I don't know. Well, oh, there's the other one. There's the other one. You guys think I'm dumb, probably, but I don't well, know how this We're not goes. hunter people. So Brandy is. Brandy and my niece and her family. What's this know. one? This is a. Oh, another Carhartt. Carhartt. FR. This one is a little thicker than that one. FR. What I've is, never seen the FR. I don't does know. Does it mean what. fire resistant? FR. Flame resistant, yep. Flame resistant. Look at that. That is nice. Really, really nice. They look in good condition. Yeah. These were in the garage? In the shed, yeah, in the yeah, the big garage. What's the what size? It is a I don't have my glasses on, honey. Oh, well then <laughs> not a good idea. That's an extra large right there. Very, very cool. And then something else that same color. It looks like Bevers. The insulated. Yeah, they're heavy. Oh, Carhartt. How do you know already? More Carhartt. I saw the emblem right by your hand there. Oh, there. Right there. Carhartt insulated coveralls. Okay. Look at that. That is a tote full of money right there. That's good stuff. That's awesome. Okay. I don't know what these go to. You just wear them over your know. jeans or we'll, something? We'll figure it out. Maybe. If it's hot. Cold, that's mean? awesome yeah if it's cold I mean, <laughs> no i mean if it's like not cold enough to wear a rig heavy insulated Maybe. or something I, guess. I don't know all right i'll i'll grab one more tote that was fun we'll grab one more tote before we close this storage unit up all right grab the next tote and i see golf balls on the side what do we have here teas in case we need a tea there's a bowling wrist thing Oh my goodness, or bow? So that's pretty Is it bowling bad shape. or bow? It's bowling. Is it? That's bowling too. Tees, look at all these golf balls though. These are creepers and covers. It goes way down there. So this is great to find now because we don't want to wait till winter time to get rid of golf stuff. So yeah, a whole box of golf balls and golf tees and Bowling wristbands and head covers and stuff like that. So awesome. that's what that is. Pretty simple. All right, now we're going to shut this up, go to the other one, and grab something from over there. All right, I wasn't going to take any more firehouse, fireman, fire by, <laughs> but this big one here is sitting right on top, and I just peeked in it. And man, look at it. Oh, my. Here's a new Lego Jackstone fire truck thing. And I think this is worth about 20 bucks on eBay. There's one, there's two, there's three, there's four. Oh my god. Right on top. And then there's other like toys and stuff. There's one of those guys. We've sold a couple of him with the VHS tape. We sold one of those. So I think this tote needs to come home with us. There's a Department 56 thingy right here. Is there? Department 56 Snow Village. Uh, little fire cars. Or something like that. Oh, let's just take a peek here. Looks, looks, oh, that's cool. Cool. So, that's let's, some fun stuff. Let's just take a little peek in here. What is this? Van Mark. Van Mark. Fine gifts by design. Is it sealed? Nope, it's not sealed. 
There's a little, Aww, little, cute. little kid and fire truck thing. Oh, sweet cakes. Sweet cakes, okay. We'll just go through a few of the things in here. I don't know that we're going to get all the way to the bottom, but we're going to take some looks here. Precious Moments. I'm not going to dig that out. It's a Love Rescued Me, little fireman. Precious Moment. Uh, some Matchbox cars. Faith Builders by Dixons. I don't know. Oh, is that not opened? That might be sealed. That is not torn. So I'm not sure what that is. We'll have to look that up. Okay. Um, this, we sold one of these for sure. We're just going to dig in because okay. here we are. Filming. I hate for somebody to say, you don't show us what's in there. You suck. <laughs> uh, that's some kind of little... Looks like maybe a little miniature pedal car. Cool. If that's what it is. Uh oh. If I can get it out. Maybe push from that in. Oh, it's like a long ways to get to it. A lot of work. Oh, another wrap. Is it a pedal? And then somewhere down in here. Oh, that's cute. Yeah. Popular Imports Inc. So anyway, little fire truck figure. It's gonna take me ten minutes to get it all back put back together. Okay, there and there's this guy. And then there's a couple more matchboxes. Here's a Tonka truck box. Another matchbox. And then down here, I just want to see what these are. The ultimate, ultimate Oops. search and rescue guy, kid connection set. Um, nothing too fancy there, but that's new. That's fun. Mm -hmm. And then, so then we have this just play set. That's fun. Mm -hmm. Kids will like that. Mm -hmm. But then down in here, there's two. Search and Rescue G.I. Joes. Oh, he's cool. Yeah, we've sold, we had a few G.I. Joes so far, and they've sold already, I think. So that's cool. There's another one exactly like it down in there. There's another Department 56 thing there. It's like an old fire pump thing. Um, a couple bears, Boyd's bears, another stone. It's a different set. Oh, and there's and a winter something Dillard's. Do we want to get this out? I guess we're here. Here we go. It's a firehouse um, fire department. Winter Glen by Dillard's. Yeah. Ashton Ashton Engine Company. Yep. So, yeah. So that's a fun box. There's some good stuff here. It's all new, easy to list, easy to ship. What's this thing? Easy to easy. There's that's more another, of these. It wasn't that fancy. Let's let's look in here though. Oh yeah, there's some more little boxes here. Department 56. The small things here. Do you want to put these big ones back in? Yeah. Let's just take a look in here, and then we'll wrap up this box. Postcards? Oh, the Twin Towers. Postcards are the Twin Towers. Oh, wow. So that's cool. Um, from 2000. Crazy. That was a year before the Twin Towers fell. Anyway, that's this box. We're going to call it good. We're going to put it back together. All right. Donna's hot and sweaty. We're going to do the last one we're going to do here. Here we go, the turtles. All right. I don't know what he is. I don't know what he is either. He's a turtle of some sort. And then there's a few little bitty turtles. I'll set these up here. 
Little turtle chalk. planter or something. Oh my goodness, look at that little turtle. Um, yeah. Look at this turtle. Oh, he sells shells. That's cool. That's pretty cool. Little bitty show. There's, turtle. There's another one down in here. That's cool. When we told you guys we had tur turtles, we were not kidding. We have turtles. Big old tortoise. This looks like a trinket box. Avon. Maybe it's cream sachet. This says. a cologne thing. Perfume thing. Oh. oh my goodness. Turtle. And then just look in here. There's just so many turtles. 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 There's an old turtle ashtray, maybe? I think it's an ashtray. There's an indent, yeah. Ashtray? That's an old turtle ashtray there, I think. It's old Southwest ornament. There's an old I'm sorry turtle, little sad little turtle. He looks like he's flocked. Is he yeah, flocked? Yeah, he is flocked. Hmm, flocked. That's an old turtle right there. It says March 15, 1978. There's a little turtle. Some more turtles down in there. More turtle there. There's a turtle candle down in there. Keepers, guys. There's some stone on. Trying to get some kind of cool there. Oh, stone. Oh. What do you call that? Agate? I don't know. An onyx? Onyx, maybe? I always thought onyx was black, but I guess it's not necessarily. Oh. I might break something. I'm trying not to. Here we go. Like a candle holder there. Another turtle. Here, let me hold something for you. A fancy glass here. A little fancy glass here. People are going to be like, he's breaking stuff. I know. It's he's, not on purpose. He's my boy. It's not on purpose. That one says Kentucky. That one says Kentucky, yep. Kentucky, Japan. Uh -huh. I didn't know there was a Kentucky, Japan. All right, last thing we're gonna show here. If I can do without breaking something. It is a little basket. Oh. Yay! Donna Yay. likes those. And they say do not hold them by the handles. Correct. Made in Romania. Very cool. Yeah. All right, we're gonna wrap these things up. We're gonna get this stuff loaded in the van. We're gonna call this a day, and we have some new fun stuff to work on this weekend so we can get out of our funk. Yes. All right, now you ready to go home? Yes. All right, everybody, hey, thanks for watching. Everyone, everyone that watches, thank you. Anything else, Donna? Like and subscribe and share with your friends. All right, hey, y'all take care. Be nice to everybody and we'll see you on the next one. I'm Steve. I'm Donna. We're happier treasures. See ya. Bye.